Here's how to delete the cache in Microsoft Teams for Mac. First, you're going to need to quit Microsoft Teams, the application. And then we're going to delete the following files in the following folders. The list is here, and we're going to select each one individually, copy that uh, path, and then go to the Go menu on your Finder, and go to Folder. And we're going to paste that link in. Keep in mind, uh, you're not going to pick the quotes from the beginning and after. We're going to place that uh, in there, hit go, and it's going to go right to the folder. We're going to select everything in the folder and we're going to delete it. And the reason why I'm showing you this is that you're going to delete the files from the following folders, not the folders. So we're going to move those to the trash by right clicking, or you can drag and drop either way. And then we're going to go to the next one and we're going to keep doing this for each of these line items. We're just going to copy them, leave out the quotes. Go to the Go menu, go to Folder, paste the path, hit Go, brings us right to the folder. Take that entire folder and move it to the trash by right-clicking. And again, we go on to the next one. And again, not selecting the quotations from before or after. Copy the path, go back to the Go menu, go to Folder, paste, Go, and this one has a lot of it in it, so when I select this and I delete it to the uh, trash, it's going to take a few seconds uh, for it to clear out. There was a lot of cache in here. Now, what's good about this is as it's clearing out all of this cache, it's going to uh, make Microsoft Teams run better and it also uh, will solve the problem uh, of that some people are having uh, connecting to meetings, etc. So this will help. Next, we're going to go to the next one and just keep going through this until we're done. Go to the Go menu, go to Folder, Paste, Go, delete those two files, right click, move to Trash, and Next. Copy the file, no quotes, click on the Finder, hit the Go menu, go to Folder, Paste, hit go, delete whatever files are in there, move to the trash, and ready for the next one. Got three more to go. Copy, click on the finder, hit the go menu, go to folder, paste, delete that whole folder move to trash. Remember I'm right clicking to get to that one. Two more to go. Highlight it. Remember not selecting the quotes. Hit the go menu. Go to folder. Paste. Hit go. We've got that folder. We're going to delete that as well. Move to trash. And last but not least, there we go. Copy it. Again, go to the Go menu, go to Folder, paste it, hit Go, find the file in there, move to Trash, and now we're done. Last step is to just restart Teams, and it might take a few minutes to reload, but it'll work just fine. Just wanted to say thank you for listening, and please subscribe to my channel, and if you liked the video, give me a like. Have a great day and stay safe.